Hey koalas! So in this video, I will show you how to grow beans. Um, so this is a tiny experiment that's easy to do at home. All you need is cotton, um, which I provided in pack six, a glass jar. Um, hopefully by now you have been recycling and um, have recycled a, a glass jar. Um, it's important to use um, a glass jar or something that is see-through so you can see inside um, how your bean grows, okay? You can watch it grow. Um, next, I provided some kidney beans, these ones, in the pack, and some red beans. So we're going to use two different types of beans here, okay? And at home, you will need some water, which is really easy to get. So, first we are going to take our glass jar and we're going to stuff it with cotton. Very simple, okay? Just like that. Just put all the cotton, you want it nice and full. Okay. Tap it down like that. Make sure it's squished in, nicely packed. Okay, just like that. Ta -da. Next, you don't have to put all these beans, especially if your jar is small like mine. You can just put two or four. Okay, I'm gonna put, I'm just gonna put four. So I'm going to put my red beans um, on the side there, just like this, so you can see it. And I'm going to put the other red bean, not too close, okay, so there's space for them to grow, just like that. And then whoop, I'm going to turn my glass jar and I'm going to put my kidney beans. Just there, choop, 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 just like that. And another kidney bean, just here. Ta-da, okay. So you should have something that looks like this. Next, so these are spare ones. You can always use them um, in another jar. I think six is too much in a jar. If your jar is big, you can use all six beans, but if not, I think four is enough or even two, depending on how big or small your jar is. So, next step, <laughs> what should we do now? Do you know? We should water it. So I'm gonna take this. or bean needs water to grow. So I'm just gonna gently pour some water. You don't want it to be too wet. Just so all the cotton is damp, like that. And the excess water, you can pour it out. Pour out the excess water, okay? So now, my beans are nice and happy in their um, cotton bed, in their wet, damp cotton bed. Next, what else do these beans need to grow properly? What else do they need? So, water and sunlight. So, once you're done with this, you're going to find a sunny spot at home. Um, where you can watch your beans grow, okay? And you won't want to move them. So make sure you find a nice spot because they're gonna be there until your beans grow or however long um, your plant survives. So I'm gonna pick maybe a spot here and I know that in the afternoon the sun shines here. 
So I'm just gonna leave it here. And yeah, we'll watch it grow. So um, make sure that every day your beans are getting sunlight and that the cotton is always damp. So you're gonna probably have to water it every day. All right, I know you can do this. I know that you can care for these beans and I can't wait to see your videos and photos of um, your beans growing, okay? So it's gonna take some time. It's not gonna happen overnight. You're probably gonna have to wait um, a few days to watch um, your bean transform into a plant. <laughs>